Hi there everybody, so we're recording. Hi there everybody, so I thought I'd make a little quick catch up video while I'm out here, out on the, the moors. There's white wells down there. Anyway, um, I'm doing a little uh, time lapse, the camera's over there. Uh, the camera's over there snapping away, uh, just over 2,200, well, exactly 2,200 photographs for a time lapse, which should end in about half an hour. And so to kill time, i um, <laughs> got to do a little catch a video about stuff and so on. Autumn is upon us. As you can see, everything is all getting brown and orange and, you know, autumn colours are coming in. It's looking fairly pretty in places. Uh, you might hair is getting a bit messy as well so do a bit of a snip of that in a few days in a day or two um <laughs> funny thing happened speaking of uh move removing hair uh this afternoon um somebody commented on a video that i posted here on the youtube about 10 years ago about this thing called uh, uh goatee saver it's this a contraption you put on your face so you can shave the perfect goatee type beard uh, my sister gave it to me all those years ago. <laughs> yeah, more as a as much as a joke as anything else. Really. And I tried it out once, and uh, yeah, uh, and somebody commented in the video saying that uh, creatures on me, saying that uh, it was recommended to them, which is uh, a big surprise to me. You know. Why would anybody? Why would YouTube recommend a ten-year-old video that about somebody having a shave? Uh, ouch tiny creeping things going on me anyway so you know to, to which i replied that i was quite surprised that somebody did that so the comment my reply comment got a like hopefully from the commenter the original commenter i replied to so you know thumbs up by the way if watching this video thumbs up <laughs> anyway uh so that's where we are now you know strange things happening on youtube videos by a practical nobody like myself over 200 subscribers wow is getting recommended to somebody who has no <laughs> no subscribers because he doesn't post any videos at all so what can you do man anyway it is getting cold that's why i'm wearing the uh, coat and uh cold is well winter's coming uh hopefully i'll be able to keep the lights on this winter uh my energy supplier told me that they're reducing my payments to something I can actually afford. Um, big surprise, I've cut nearly half of my monthly payment off. Um, this worries me a little bit because, you know, that means that uh, sometime in the very near future it's going to go up to something I can't afford. So, so I'll just keep an eye on that. But, uh, you know, I'm not in that... <laughs> It's not that much of a, a worry, even though it probably should be to me, but yeah. again, there's really nothing I can do about it right now, so I'll just keep on going and hopefully things will be fine. Hopefully. Uh, in other news, my modelling has come to a bit of a stop. Uh, by modelling, I mean the model kits and that, you know, this stuff. <laughs> uh, I touch any modeling thing since I finished the little Spitfire um, just haven't felt the urge to do so I got you know like a dozen or more videos I've recorded in the past year and a half or so past two years that I haven't edited that I would like to edit uh, mostly reviews about models and that so or the kits I have rather so and I've got a video that I finished editing a couple of days ago actually so a 10 minute video part one of the engine of a 124 scale Messerschmitt 109 G2 I believe there are so many versions of that airplane and it's, yeah, it's uh, amazing there's so many versions of that kit available at actually in all scales uh, the commonest being the 148th or 172nd scale just watched a video yesterday about somebody building his you know fifth or sixth model of it uh, so and uh, by Edward, which I've I've got a version of in the stash somewhere. Um, so 
there's that. I'm 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 considering making uh, either a Willis Jeep, a well, quarter ton truck it says on the box, but it's quite clearly a Willis Jeep. Uh, the picture looks exactly like a Willis Jeep, so I call it the Willis Jeep uh, because I've got a I've already made a uh, an inbox review of that. You get to edit it, but yeah. But also, I'm quite considering putting together the uh, uh, Bandai TIE Fighter, 170 second scale TIE Fighter. Uh, mainly because uh, I've been watching Andor, the new Star Wars TV series from uh, Disney Plus. And uh, it's a fairly slow it's story, it's, but it is, in my own opinion, probably the best thing that 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 streamer has put out in since since the Mandalorian certainly the best TV show I've seen from them since the Mandalorian um, it's a drug going past since the Mandalorian so it's it is in my opinion the very best television series on TV right now well so streaming right now and uh, you know they're on of what I, I watched episode eight this morning uh, and it's it's still keeping going. It's it's keeping my attention. The story is very good. It's keeping my attention. So episode six, I think, was a highlight so far because uh, uh, it was like a finale. You know, when the show ended, I just sat there and you know, yeah, you know, took the time to get my breath back, tried to relax, take it easy, and uh, yeah, it felt. The same way that I did when I was watching the uh, uh, chapter 16 of The Mandalorian, that uh, season finale of season two. Um, but there you go. So, so yeah, if you want to watch a really good show and you and you have Disney Plus, watch Andor. It's uh, it is a very good show. Yeah. There's a lot of people out there saying that it's not a very good show, mainly because it's a bit slow, it takes its time, it's ponderous. But the story, the story is what's keeping me going. And it's a very well told story. The performances are top notch. Um, um, from Andor himself, uh, what's his name? <laughs> Can't remember the chap's name who plays him, but uh, he's very good. Uh, supporting actors, um, what's his name? <laughs> All the names have disappeared. There's only one name I can remember off my off the top of my head. Faye Marseille plays a character called Vel, and uh, she appeared in episodes four, five, and six. And so, well, she first appeared in episode four, episode four and she's been very good. Uh, uh, her performance in episode six was impeccable. <laughs> you know, she went from being, the, you know, angry boss girl to, in a couple of things, just looking absolutely terrified at what she's about to do, but, and had to be pushed on by her partner in crime. Um, anyway, that was a, again, a very impressive performance. Uh, uh, the sweet is he a Swedish guy? Stellan Skarsgård, he's in it as well. He's very impressive with that. So anyway, watch the show. You'll see what I mean. Uh, recommendation of the day. Andor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Somebody did a thing where they, uh, instead of saying Andor, they just played this song. Andor. Which made me laugh a bit too. Anyway, that's all for the moment. Um, um, there's other, not so much drama, but uh, interesting things happening at work. Well, uh, one of our film scanner, well, our film scanner is uh, not working. Well, it is working, but the computer that runs off it isn't working. It's a Windows XP, so that computer just Okay, the blue screen of death, the dead completely. And because the uh, it's provided by Kodak along with the scanner, you know, it's almost impossible to uh, just get it working properly. So we're having to try to get hold of, uh, excuse me, we're having to try to get hold of a software to get this scanner working, to drive the scanner. Unfortunately, it's, it's an old scanner, it's not supported anymore. And while there appears to be a lot of people out there using this thing, getting hold of software to drive it is very difficult. It seems you need to be somebody who's good at coding to actually get this into work. So, and 
we're trying that as well you know <laughs> we know a few people who know computers so but if that doesn't work we, we, we may have to make a, a bit of a massive investment for a small company to uh, get another machine or or maybe just stop doing film or after scanning film processing the film is easy because you just you know the film processes is a is in good working condition it's been serviced recently it's working well no problems there it's the film scanner that's the issue so. anyway that's uh that's that's just work stuff so you know i don't like to talk shop on this channel or any where you know in private so yeah anyway i'm gonna wait for this uh thing to finish uh taking pictures to solve their beyond and uh then i'm gonna go home down the hill back home i'm gonna come out here uh, for the exercise yeah, I try to do a bit of exercise every day, just going out for a walk. I found that if I don't, if I just stay in the house all day, which I quite like to do actually sometimes, I, uh, you know, I, I feel lethargic, tired, which is a bit odd. If you're not actually exerting at all, and uh, I don't sleep as well. I find that if I go out and you know spend just you know even twenty minutes just walking, it uh, it makes me feel a lot better. So little tip you know if you want to just keep up it works to help keep my health up put it that way you know? and when you get to my age you need to uh, do everything you can really and walking is easy and cheap and free <laughs> rather so yeah so what i normally do is uh set it there's a bug on the back of my hand <laughs> what i normally do is set the timer on my uh on this phone uh for 12 minutes and just get out and walk and then when it, when it hits 12 minutes then i turn around then i can turn around and walk back actually i don't turn around and walk back i continue walking if i come this way and I continue walking around and I spend another what well, as much as another hour just pootling around the uh well this place here so but you know little tip want to get a bit of exercise set the timer on your device for 10 minutes and just get out and walk as far as you can in that 10 minutes when the timer goes off turn back go home get on with the rest of the day yeah at worst you'll lose 20 minutes every day at best you'll feel better at least i do anyway thanks for watching everybody and uh take care see you next time